Hello guys, it's me once again and welcome back to the Boat Good and Do It Right channel. If you're subscribed, if not, can you take a second and hit the subscription button below the video. Alright, today's video is another simple one. We're doing a back exercise in this video and it's a seated row exercise, a variation that we will do a few tweaks to hit the lower back and then the upper back, hitting the mid traps, room boys and part of the rear delts, okay? So let's go straight into the video. We'll be using the rope attachment and this is how it is so now with a rope attachment it allows us to pull the weight around our body when we bring it towards our navel and that's the first variation seated that way with our legs planted we stretch out our lats okay so my ropes are too long so i'll pull in the middle there okay so stretching out this way allows me to stretch my lats and i pull retracting myself back and pulling across my body bringing the rope towards my navel and this one will hit that lower back okay slowly let it go pull back slowly let it go and when you do this you want to contract your back you feel it in your lower lats okay as you push your as you push your elbows past your body you feel it more in your lower lats, okay? All right, and this variation is that which will target your lower back. Let's look at the second variation. In this second variation, we're gonna be pulling the weights up this way. Okay, so what we're going to do is while we're pulling the weights, this we want to retract our scapulas in and put them together, lock our scapulas at the back. It's going to impact the, the traps up there, our rhomboids and our red delts in a small way. Okay, so this is how that variation looks like. You want to pull it towards your chest. Okay, so it looks like this. You want to lean back and pull towards your chest. Retracting your scapulas behind you. Yeah, and let's note that choosing this variant would affect how much you can stretch out your life. It rather aids in contracting your back the more or impacting by contraction and not by stretching of the muscle. So that's the problem because of the length of the rope you're using in this one. So the attachment kind of affects one side of the exercise. And again, this is just my opinion on how it feels to use it. Because in the case of a bar, I'm allowed to stretch a bit more before I pull. But then in the case of the rope, this doesn't happen once you stretch a bit you put the weights back so that's one thing you should take note of yeah so thank you very much that was the seated cable rolls with the rope attachment and um don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed and like the video i'll catch you on the next one peace out 